Hey guys, we're Above Average. This is Never Seen It, a show where we talk about a popular movie we've never seen and try and guess what it's about. I'm here with Glenn, Matt, and Andrew, who have never seen E.T. What do you guys know about E.T.? Okay. Extra terrestrial. Yes. Yes, and I also know that Reese's Pieces play some part in this movie. Oh, I yeah. think someone eats them. I thought it was, what is the sour one? Skittles. Sour. I thought I it was Skittles. I would say that Skittles are not sour. <laughs> yes, they are. No, Skittles are very sour. No, they're fruity. They're not sour. They're more sour than a Reese's Pieces. You know guys, guys, let's stay on track here. <laughs> <laughs> I think the crucial part is I feel like there's some relationship between the alien and the little boy. Yeah. That's yeah, integral they're best to friends. the movie. Become best friends, and maybe nobody believes the little boy. People never believe li children, yeah. so I feel like that kid's got a best friend that's an alien. It's a movie about two unlikely friends getting together. Two little mm -hmm. funny boys from their own planet. <laughs> Don't do this and say funny boys. <laughs> <laughs> There's the famous quote from this movie, E.T. Okay. E.T. Phone home. E.T. Phone home. E.T. wants to phone home to his planet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. He ends up communicating with his home using a child's toy from the 80s. If you have to guess what it was, what would you say that toy was? Rubik's Cube? Like, uh -huh. like uh -huh. when you finally get yeah. it all together, it, that's the... That's what happens? <laughs> I'd say uh, Mr. Potato Head. Okay. Like he holds it up to his ear like a phone and he talks into its mouth. I'm gonna say the Barbie Corvette because it has a little phone uh, <laughs> right in it. Those all seem dumb. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably none of those. <laughs> What do you think his powers are? I think he can fly or make things fly because no, he definitely would... goes up in the air. But then he fly away to his home. How else is the bike going up in the air? I don't know, love? <laughs> but I, you're gonna... saying that there's a reality <laughs> in this world not connected to E.T. that makes the bike go up. I'm sure, I just I can't I just can't imagine an alien has the power of flight. That's that he would be flying all over the place. He's a sick little alien. Can't you can't imagine fly. an alien has the power of flight? That's the easiest thing for me to imagine about an alien. <laughs> okay, a couple times E.T. has to be disguised. <laughs> what? No. I'm gonna go Robert Durst on this. <laughs> he is dressed up like a woman. In a little dress and a little wig. Yeah. Oh, God! Elia. E.T. makes something come back to life. Oh, <gasps> shit. That's one what? of his powers. No. Does he make come back to life? I bet you somebody's cat got run over by a car and he was like, look at my wizard powers. <laughs> Guys, congratulations! Yay! Yay! You did a pretty good job. You hit all the major markers. Do you guys think you'll see ET? Um, yeah, I would see it because I really want to find out if the candy is in it or not. Well, we'll all have to watch ET now to find out about Reese's Pieces. So join us next week when we all watch ET together. Yeah, we're all just gonna watch it in real time. And talk we're just about gonna it. post it on YouTube and then mm -hmm. uh, we'll all watch it together and then we'll all get sued. If you guys like free movies, check above average. The bad boys of the yeah. internet, we do not care. Oh, yeah. Money, money, money. Uh, if you like that vid, click sub. Check out more vids on Above Av. Rich. <laughs>